Now, the latest on the campaign to save Walthamstow Dogs Track. The last race is set to be next week with plans to build housing on the site. From Winston Churchill to the craze, the track has seen it all since racing started in 1933. And one lady who remembers much of it, 94-year-old Madge. She's worked there for an incredible 66 years. Phil Bales has been to meet some of the staff who spent most of their lives working at Walthamstow Dogs. With a combined age of 178, Madge and Joyce clock on for work at Walthamstow Dogs, as they have done for the past 66 years. But the threat of closure hangs over the track, and with it, the loss of their jobs. When you've been doing it all those years, it's all to magic, isn't it? Yeah. Right? Yeah. What will you miss? Sorry? What will you miss? The people. The people. The, it's um, the company. Everything. We enjoy it. We enjoy meeting all these different people. 94 years old and Madge is still at her post on the tote, close to the finishing line. Upstairs in the winner's enclosure, Joyce Middleton, a youngster at a mere 84, is relieving the punters of their wages on the race about to start. When was the big, big time here, do you think? When was it? Just after the war? Mm. Yeah, just after the war, I should think. Yeah. I mean, we, we enjoyed it during the war, but I think after the war, that's when it started to pick up again. The irony is that with all this talk of closure, the Stow has never been busier. Madge and Joyce have been flat out working at five race meetings a week, just like the good old days. If only they'd had crowds like this a year ago, the Stow might have survived the developers' bulldozers, though it's not over yet. Football legend Teddy Sheringham is among a galaxy of supporters backing a last-minute rescue package. It's a bit of history here with, with Walthamstow Dogs, you know, There's loads of people all around. People come to Walthamstow, you talk, talk about Walthamstow Dogs. And uh, it's, it's certainly been in my family over, over many, many years and uh, it's a lovely night out. It's, it's a nice friendly occasion when you come over here and uh, it helps if you win as well. Racing here a week tomorrow could be the last. Some of the staff have already left but Madge and Joyce have soldiered on, doing what they love best. What are you going to do with yourself then when you have to retire? God knows. I thought of that today. I don't really know. And what did you think? Sitting indoors doing nothing. Cool, we go mad sitting indoors doing nothing. <laughs> don't we? Mm, I don't mm. We really don't know. We're not looking forward to it at, at all. all. No, not. Supporters paraded in favour of the rescue package. The Stowe's oldest workers hope they win, saying the problem is no one will employ them at their age. Phil Bales, London Tonight, Walthamstow.